Hello and greetings to everyone. Welcome to Unit 2 of this course. In Unit 1, we examined definitions of open educational resources. In this unit, which is Unit 2, we are going to identify types and characteristics of open educational resources. Recall that open educational resources was defined as teaching, learning and research resources that reside in the public domain or have been released under an intellectual property license that permits their free use and repurposing by others. Let us identify types of open educational resources. They include full courses, course materials, lecture notes, modules, textbooks, reading lists, course assignments, quizzes, syllabi and lesson plans, articles, data, streaming videos, audio clips, instructional games, software, and any other tools, materials or techniques used to support access to knowledge. What then are the characteristics of open educational resources? OERs are basically teaching and learning materials. Teachers use open educational resources to teach, while learners use OERs to learn. OER for teaching is more targeted and specialized. For learners, it is broader. For teaching, OERs are designed with a professional aim. They are designed with specific learning needs. We also need to note that OERs can be published in any medium. In addition, open educational resources can be characterized by the five R's. What are these five R's? They are reuse, revise, remix, redistribute, and retain. So let us look at each of them and their meaning one after the other. What do we mean by reuse? It gives the right to use the content in a wide range. For example, in a classroom setting, a study group, website, video, and so on. Revise gives us the right to adapt adjust, modify, or alter the content itself. For example, we can translate the content in another language. Remix provides the right to combine the original or revised content with another material to create something new. Redistribute gives us the right to share copies of the original content, your revisions or your remixes with others. Retain gives us the right to own, make, and control copies of the content. For example, download, copy, store, and manage the content. It is also worthy of note that the five R's of open educational resources was coined by David Wiley. Wiley is an advocate of copy-free content. He described open content as any copyrightable work that is licensed in a manner that provides users with free and perpetual permission to engage in the five R's. The five R's is at the core of open licensing system. Here, rights owners retain authorship but grant specific rights to users of their resources provided they respect certain conditions. I hope you find this unit interesting. See you soon.